This graphics card is massive. To put it into perspective, behind it, I have AMD's flagship graphics card from just a few years ago. The Radeon 7. Yeah, this thing is enormous. These have the same amount of VRAM. This is a 16 gigabyte RX 6900 XT, and this is a 16 gigabyte RX Radeon 7. Yet for some reason, this card is fucking enormous. Now, I know this is an AIB partner card, and this is a not AIB partner card, but they didn't make partner cards for the Radeon 7, but I just thought it was a nice point of comparison to use to show that this card is massive. Hold on, do I have a banana? Look how big this card is! Banana for scale. Yeah, that, that's really the whole point of this video. That I, I plan to use this card in, in a really sick build coming up soon, so I just wanted to show it off in its own video before I did that. It has three PCI Express 8-pin power connectors. I think it's a bit unnecessary, but that's freaking insane. Holy crap. Three of them. I only have one other card that has three 8-pin power connectors. And that's the RX Radeon Pro Duo from like eight, nine years ago. This thing also has three 8-pin connectors on it. But this is a dual GPU card. So that's kind of... Okay, don't worry, that card's broken. If anyone has a replacement, send it. Alright, I just wanted to, to leer out this card for a few minutes, and I thought you guys would be interested in seeing that this thing is massive. It's just fucking massive. It's fucking enormous, man. It's huge. And I plan to be, I'm going to use it in a new uh, build coming soon, so hopefully you guys stick around for that, because man, it's going to be sick. Going to be uh, over $5,000 in PC parts in that build, so stick around. This card is enormous. It's, it's huge. It is... I, I cannot stress this enough that this card is massive. Thank you guys so much for watching. Hope to see you guys in the next one. I love you guys. I'll see you in the next one. Peace.